Hey guys, um, I just wanted to make this video and possibly help some people out. I actually had this SD card uh, structure, file structure error when I got my um, Terminator, which was late October. Um, I see a lot of people still struggling with this, so I just kind of wanted to make a video to possibly help people out with it. So I don't have a means to screen capture and I have the software for it, but uh, What you're gonna go ahead and do and This is after you do the preliminary checks obviously um, I just see a lot of bad advice going around I'm gonna take it away from there uh, a lot of bad advice going around from people that just tell you to do a, a new TPS reset, which isn't ever going to fix the issue. Um, obviously, check your grounds, power to the ECU. Um, but what had actually happened with me personally is that I had a GCF that I made in the car on the handheld and then went to go transfer it via the SD card to my laptop, modified it, and then uh, go to upload it again to the handheld to the ECU and it just wouldn't, it gives you the file structure error. So I know a lot of guys don't have the USB to CAN adapter uh, right off. And I kind of struggled with this on a weekend trying to figure it out. But this is actually your file data for the SD card that needs to be changed if this is your issue. So if you have this same TRX 0106 uh, then you're most likely your SD card contents are up to date. But if you have a different one, you want to take this and this SN EFI uh, and put it in a separate file somewhere else. And then you go on to holly.com, uh, go to the support tab, which is all the way over here to the right, click on it, then you click on EFI software. I'm in my back room. Oh, it actually loaded pretty quickly. This SD card contents right here, which is the third one down, you download that. And that should be the most up-to-date version. For whatever reason, um, they did not upload the most newest version when the uh, when the Terminator X's came out. Um, like I said, I bought mine in late October, and that um, it still had this issue. And the SD card contents actually has been out for a long time uh, before that, but. You go ahead, pull both of these files out of here. Um, take the file, download it, and unzip it in this uh, section, which is SD, you know, your SD card, Holly, um, FW0100, and then dump it in there, and then unzip it. And what you'll do is you'll have your car... <clears throat> Once you get that downloaded, you're going to lose your uh, GCFs, just so you know. Um, once you have that downloaded, you pop this back in your car. It'll um, it'll take a while to load, uh, like a long boot. And then uh, it'll have you TPS auto reset. And then you have to build a new uh, GCF from there. 
and then you'll be able to transfer files. Um, the other issue that I have seen is people don't put the saved GCFs in the actual bin for the saved GCF. They just put it in the in this folder. Um, that's just user error. You just want to make sure that your saved GCFs in this top folder. Um, like I said, I just want to make this hopefully help some people out. I know I usually only get to my uh, work on my car on the weekend, so um, usually that's when Holly, you know, doesn't have their tech support open, so very hard to uh, get stuff done. Hopefully this helps some people out. Thank you guys for watching.